My name is Stephanie Christensen. I am a sophomore and I'm a global health major and I'm from around here, Ahwatukee, Phoenix, AZ. I am a part of the American Medical Student Association and that is a club that helps pre-health and pre-med students hear from actual doctors who come in to speak, learn about their careers and their futures and find volunteer opportunities. And I'm the community service coordinator for that so I plan a lot of the volunteer events. I'm also community service coordinator for the Pre-Physician Assistant Club. It's for any future PA students to learn about what it would be like in that field and also hear from PAs and also go to volunteer events. So I organize a lot of events for those clubs. Um, they're big group one-time volunteer events at places throughout the valley, so Project Cure, um, St. Mary's Food Bank. Sometimes we do on-campus ones. The most recent one we did was for Hospice of the Valley, and that was an on-campus pop-up booth. And we had donated clothes that we were selling in like a thrift store style, and we actually raised $500 that went all towards hospice. So Ani Dasso is a student-led company out of Changemaker Central. We started my freshman year. I saw an interview that was like, come in and see how you can help people in Ghana. So I went to Changemaker Central and I interviewed with our creator, Caitlin Fitzgerald, and she told me that she goes to Ghana and knows a local craftswoman there named Dora, and she buys her products, um, Ghanaian, made bags and jewelry and they're so beautiful. They're colorful, they're exciting. We sell these bags and we, we try to market a brand for ourselves that's based in mindfulness and in providing aid in a different way. So instead of just going in and donating money or reaching help, the reason we like to bring our products in from Ghana is because we want to encourage entrepreneurs there and then we use our profits to um, send a uh, few Ghanaian children to school and as our company is growing we're hoping to expand those projects and, and help out in Ghana in any way we can. Being in all these clubs um, and companies and in student life has really given me so many experiences that I would never have expected coming into college. I'm kind of always trying to do everything possible because I feel like by being a part of each of these things, I just get to add on these experiences in my life that help me understand people better and help me meet more people. I'm always busy, but I love it. I wouldn't have it any other way. In the future, I clearly want to go to PA school. Uh, that's why I'm in the pre-PA club. Um, I kind of decided that healthcare was my highest priority. I I think it's one of the best ways that I can actually serve other people and help other people. Like I don't think there's anything more raw than like being able to actually heal people and help people feel better. And that's why I love global health so much too because we address those issues on such a large scale. That's something that I want to continue to do with my future. So whether I start off in PA school, I want to make sure that I'm getting out there globally to solve problems or whatever needs to be done. That can impact individuals but also impact people on a big scale too.